All right, what's good, YouTube? It is the middle of the night, um, and uh, I'm actually going to do a pomade review. I just got in from a skate session. I went out skating for a couple hours, probably the longest skate session I've had in a while. Um, I went to a shopping center near me, and uh, everything's closed, so I was uh, pretty unbothered. And uh, anyway, I got home. Uh, I'm working on, I'm setting up uh, two uh, boards. Uh, one is uh, a backup setup that I had that I'm taking apart and putting the deck on my old trucks and wheels and the, uh, trucks and some other components are going on the Andy board. So that's coming soon. Um, but since I just took a shower to get myself all clean again, I thought I would, my hair's still a little damp, I would try this hardworking gentleman wax, which I have heretofore not tried yet. So this stuff offers a matte finish and a firm hold. I don't know if that's, it looks blurry where I'm standing, but made with uh, beeswax, carnauba, carno, carnauba wax, uh, jojoba oil and castor oil, good stuff. So um, let's dig into this. Let's check it out. I like the packaging, super basic. A couple of these that I got just came the jars and a couple came in, uh, actually one came just the jar and a couple came in a box. I'm not sure why that was, but here it is. Let's see what this stuff smells like. Very little smell to it. It almost smells unscented. Let's see what it how it comes out. Oh, it's pretty stiff. It's actually really stiff. This is like beyond Murray's superior stiff. I don't know if you guys can see how hard it is to get this stuff out. It's very waxy. Um, I might have to use the old fingernail method here dig it out. This is super hard, so it'll be interesting to see how this works. It does kind of break apart a little bit when you spread it. It's kind of hard to see in this light. Um, so it doesn't feel as much like a true wax as some other stuff I've used. It kind of falls apart. But let's throw some in and see how it how it goes on the hair. I'm gonna file this one under crazy hard pomades. I'll be interested to see if this, how it performs, if it falls into the trap of some heavy pomades just weighing down the hair or if it really helps to give some serious hold and volume. It's going into the hair feels pretty good. Of the products of theirs I've tried, I'm liking the way this feels going into the hair the best, I think. It feels the most natural. It's more like an old school pomade. Now, I have not used a lot. <clears throat> you can see there, barely made a dent in it, but it feels like a little is gonna go a long way, so let's try it out. I gotta say, this feels pretty good. It's It's got the hold of like an old school pomade, like a Murray's. It's not as gummy as Murray's, so. It's actually got kind of a nice, clean, matte finish. 
not overly tacky kind of hold and look at this volume. I mean, it just goes up and up and up. This is a good one, guys. It really is. Look at this. Bam. I don't know what was going on with my hair for a while. I felt like it was getting really thin and really fine. I don't know if my diet was bad or I was in a stressful period. I didn't feel stressed out, but I was just having trouble getting any kind of height out of, um, out of my style. And I thought my hair was just moving past its prime, but maybe it's the products I've been using um, I'm just wondering if maybe some of the stuff, like I've been using too much um, of those like kind of oil-based uh, medium weight pomades that don't really give hold uh, or performance and they've just been weighing down my hair or plugging up my scalp or something, but whatever. This stuff, hardworking gentleman wax, I recommend. I like it. Um, it does have some kind of some kind of faint scent. It just smells really kind of vanilla. Well, not vanilla scent. It it it's it smells kind of just plain, you know. Which if you if you have to err on the side of smelling bad, smelling too strong, or having some goofball like fruity scent that some of these pomade makers use it's better to just have it smell plain in my opinion because you can always throw uh, a fragrance on but i really like the way this performs and i would definitely buy this one again for sure for those days when i'm getting out of a shower and i want to put something into damp hair that's going to really hold well get you some. That's it guys. I'm going to get back to putting my skate setups together. Uh, I'll do another quick video just kind of showcasing them. I'm not going to bore you with a video of me actually assembling them because it would be super long and I don't know. I don't have software to speed it up and make my voice like a chipmunk. So I'm just going to show you the completed product when I'm done and we'll go from there. Um, there are far better people than me at setting up boards and far more interesting for you to watch out there. So I'm sure you won't miss it. Anyway, in the meantime, um, smash the like button if you like this video. It helps my channel performance. And if you're not already a subscriber, I invite you to join. Um, I'm always posting new content. If you want to get notified every time I post something new, hit the little bell icon. You'll get all my notifications. and. Um, See you next time. Later. God bless.